So I've been playing Genshin for a year now, and Genshin has become so easy. And so I thought, what can you do to make it more challenging? So I laid my ass down and thought about it, and concluded that the characters in Genshin actually makes the game easier. So if characters make the game easier, why not stop wishing on the characters? So I created an account where I can only pull in the weapon banner, and this is day one of this account. This is kind of similar with the challenge in Pokemon called Nuzlac. There will be no rerolls. We take what the game gives us. Now, here are the rules. First, Primos can only be used in the weapon banner. You cannot use it in the standard banner. However, now the second rule is Acquaint Fates can be used in the standard banner. Third is we can use the Star Glitter to buy characters from the shop and also weapons. This account will be purely free to play and lastly, to make sure I don't cheat my audience, I will only use this account on stream. Now, let's see how many weeks or months can we 36 star abyss with a weapon banner only account. A quick reminder that I stream here on YouTube every day 8am Philippine time. Also, we do have a Discord channel so if you want to join it's in the description. With that, let's begin the journey. One for Aether, two for Lumine. Okay. So now, chat chose Lumine and we named it uh, F2P Siron. Okay. Oops! Stop, 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 stop right there. Yep, yep, yep. There, 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 there. As I pride myself on finishing the Abyss 36 star every two weeks as an AR-58 player, yes, I am a sweat. And I need to touch, touch some grass. And because of that, I know that there is a chest behind that stupid rock. I'm a sweat. That's why I know. But like... And by just tapping the sprint button all the way to that rock, I am, com I am consuming less stamina. But... Traversing really efficiently, which allows me to do the thing that pro players in first-person shooting games like Apex, Valorant, CSGO do in pro matches, which is called tap strafing. No, dude! No! 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 Never mind. We continue. Okay. I cannot play for 10 hours a day as I have a day job as well. I speed run through the contents of the game for us to get our free 22 or 24 wishes. I don't remember how many it was exactly, but it's not important. Now, it used to be AR7, you get free 320 wishes, but now you can get it on AR10, which makes it harder. We did not want to gather Electroculus nor pick up any chest because we will use the interactive map to 100% the map on a later date. Hence the reason this was so hard. At AR9, I went to Dragon Spine in order to light up the stupid tree and I absolutely own Dragon Spine. At AR9. Mm -hmm. okay. Pull for any... For any... Uh, for any banner? Uh, only the weapon banner? <laughs> only the weapon banner? <laughs> so... Uh, yeah... We absolutely got owned. Now we unlock the tree. We get more. We get more ARs, yeah. Yo, just get me AR. Oh. <laughs> Why is he charging? Why is he charging? <laughs> but nevertheless, we got the tree and got AR10 finally. <laughs> AR10. <laughs> AR10. So after an hour and a half of speedrunning through the game, we can now wish for our first 22 wishes. Now, you might be thinking, why are you wishing on the beginner banner? It's because I need characters and the beginner banner has a guaranteed Noel. Let's go. 
Okay, four star. Yeah, let me get the Noel. Let me get my Noel, please. Let me get my Noel. Let me get my Noel. I need to get the Noel. Yeah. Let's go. Oh. Noel. Okay, one more Noel. No. Yes, a Barbara. Let's go. I have a healer now. Oh my god, no way. No way. I have a character. No way. I have a character. The prototype Rancor, and then we have Adventure Box. We have this. The Barbara is good. The Barbara is good. I, 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 I like the Barbara, yeah? And we'll do this. And then we'll do. Now, of course, as we have limited characters, what we want here is good, usable characters to tackle the world exploration. Hence, Parallel Abyss. Now, Akaya, Amber, or Alisa constellation would absolutely destroy this account. <laughs> no. No. no way! No way! No way! No way, man! No way! No way! <laughs> no way, man! I just want the character! No! No way, man! The most useful for us is a primordial jade spear. Rather than a Calamity Queller, I think. Because we're gonna get it on the first pull. This is not Copium. We are gonna get it on the first pull. <laughs> and I started to inhale a lot of Copium in this one as I was starting to grieve because of the Lisa and Barbara pull. So I charted my way to that crispy primordial Jade Spear. So... Okay, Paul! Paul! Fucking Paul! Oh, first and four star! Please be a character! Dragon Alitics, man! I'll fucking take it, man! I'll fucking take it! I'll, take, I'll fucking take it! I'll fucking take it, dude! I'll fucking take it! I'll fucking take it, guy. My guy. Hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. This is gonna be gold right here. <laughs> it's not enough! <laughs> And that's all of it for day one. Nah, I'm just messing with you. We have one more pull because I did not see it the first time. But I was able to see it so that we can buy another one. So yeah. Monthly reset. Where is it? I can't buy... Oh, oh. Ha <laughs> ha
button. So yeah, that is day one. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the video. Like and sub for more. And I want to post this series every day, but I have a full-time job. So it's going to be hard, but I hope I can. See you in the next video and have a good day.